Today's morning minute, kingdom living is spirit. We read in John chapter 4, verses 23 through 24. A time will come, however, indeed, it is already here, when the true genuine worshipers will worship the Father, worship the Father in spirit and in truth, reality. For the Father is seeking just such people as these, as his worshipers. God is a spirit, a spiritual being, and those who worship him must worship him in spirit and in truth, reality. Jesus Jesus tells us God is spirit, and we must worship him in the spirit and truth. The Holy Spirit lives in the born-again believer and reveals all truth to us. The Holy Spirit convicts us of our unbelief, our unbelief that we need a Savior. The Holy Spirit convicts us that we have been made righteous. We've been made righteous through the blood of Jesus Christ. The Holy Spirit convicts us that the ruler of this world, Satan, has been judged and condemned. Mankind has been redeemed and set free. You worship him in truth for who he is and who you are in him. You are his workmanship created in his image. He breathes life into you. His spirit lives in you. His spirit resides in your temple. He has made you holy and righteous by the shed blood of Jesus Christ on the cross for the redemption of your sin. He has given you everything you need. You are complete and lacking nothing in him. He has forgiven you of your sin and set you as at his right hand. You're a child of the king. You're a citizen of the kingdom of heaven. You rule and reign in this kingdom, in his kingdom. His kingdom has no poverty, recession, or lack. His kingdom has no economic collapse. His kingdom is filled with his provision. His kingdom is filled with his love. God's Holy Spirit is a, is a spring of living water welling up, bubbling, and flowing over in you. God's Spirit speaks through you. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Heaven comes to earth through God's Spirit overflowing like a river through you to others. His healing power, his word of knowledge, his discernment, his wisdom, his comfort, his blessings, his purity, his righteousness, his, his pleasure, his his favor, his grace, his mercy, his salvation, his love is a river of life running through you. We walk, we walk by faith, not by sight. Ask the Lord to open your eyes of your heart to have spiritual sight today. The Holy Spirit gives you sight into the supernatural. Ask God to give you all he has for you today. He will fill you with his glory of his presence, his power, and his goodness. Amen and amen.